Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another eyes to nails video. Um, this one is on the Pantone shades for this year, which are rose quartz and like a light baby blue. I don't know the actual names of them, but you know. Um, so basically I used two shades from ColourPop and then I had one that I found in my drawer and I've never used it before so I was like oh just you know use it because I really wanted to do like a really like light wash of the pink over my eyelid and then just the blue underneath the lower lash line and I really love how it turned out um and I feel like it's perfect for summer so yeah um if you want to see how I did this look um then keep on watching Okay, so the first thing that I'm doing after I have put primer on, I'm using the color Strength by ColourPop. Um, this is just like a really nice matte brownie shade. It's like a nude shade. Um, and I'm just putting that in my crease because I wanted to do a very sheared out pink look, but I didn't want to have just the pink because I felt like it would look a little bit odd. So I'm using Bubbly by ColourPop and it has like glitter in it. Um, and it's not super pigmented but it's not completely sheer either so I had to build it up a little bit more than I would normally do for this color um, just because I wanted it to be really pigmented at the base of the lash and then kind of blend out into the crease which right now I'm building up the color and then you will see me later on um, right now blend out where the color meets the crease so and then I'm asking adding a little bit of whisper from the naked smoky palette just to kind of add in a little little bit of a color but nothing too bad now i'm using blackout by urban decay and this is just to line my lash line use whatever works for you or totally skip this step but i felt like this totally completed the look um and yeah now I'm using Taco by ColourPop and I know this is no longer available and I'm so sorry but it was the shade that we had spoke like we had talked about like weeks ago um, for this Pantone week so I stuck to it and um, yeah so I'm just kind of blending it out so it's not as intense and super harsh on the lower lash line um, and I'm just using a clean blending brush nothing on it just blending it out um, now I'm putting on mascara and I put on my bottom lashes first um, or my bottom mascara first mainly because it helps to not get mascara on my top eyelid which is weird I read it on Facebook and I was like oh, I'll just give it a go and I've done it ever since it just works so much better for me now I'm contouring using Fawn by Anastasia Beverly Hills um, obviously do whatever works for you but I feel like contouring for me has just become such a routine thing that I just I could do it in my sleep um, and I, I do like a pretty basic contour it's not like you know I'm baking underneath and like making sure that it's super sharp like that's not me I'm pretty simple when it comes to that so again do whatever works for you um, now I'm using a NARS blush um, this one is not available, which I'm sorry about that, but it's one of my favorites. So I just, you know, I use whatever works for me. Now I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Starlight Illuminator. I love this. I've been using it for months now. Um, it's really bad because I need to like move on to other things, but I just, I can't. Um, and now I'm using the Dior Show Mascara. I love this. I, I mean, I just love it, but it doesn't hold a curl, so I'm trying to look for new mascaras even though I really don't want to. I need to because I want curled lashes. Um, so they stay curled for like five hours and they fall, so yeah. Um, now I'm using Candy K by Kylie Cosmetics. Um, I have all of the shades including Court K besides Dulce K, so I'm a little... I'm a little mad about that because I tried getting it on Monday and 
couldn't get it. Um, but yeah, I got True Brown Case, so that'll be coming soon. Uh, but yeah, do whatever you want for the lip. You could do like a really bold blue. I was really tempted to do it, but I decided not to. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and this is the final look. So this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. It's down below. Um, and also don't forget to check out 25 Sweet Pea stuff. I will have it linked down below. Um, her Twitter, Instagram, her blog post, um, everything that she's on, I will have it linked down below. And also before you guys get mad at me, um, you cannot get Taco anymore from ColourPop. It was one of their like final calls in March and when I saw that I was like, oh, why are they doing this? But, um, and they had like a lot of good shades on there too that they were getting rid of, which was kind of annoying. Um, but I had already owned all the ones that they were getting rid of. So, um, I'll try not to use them in future tutorials, but Ugh, it's gonna be hard not to um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to check out my blog down below my instagram twitter um and my snapchat and i will see you guys later bye